guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we have something just a little different. Um, we have a 2022 Tesla Model 3. So this is a what they consider their base model. It is a non-long range, non-performance version of their um, small size sedan. So it's a pretty little, no, neat little car. Um, the, the wheels is pretty much the only option, upgraded option on this. Other than that, this is pretty much how all of them come. Um, they have a couple interior variants, a couple exterior colors you can choose from, but a lot of them you're gonna be seeing on the road are this. So I figured I'd just kind of show you guys around it and something a little different for the channel. Um, so it has flush door handles, completely flush. And so you just push it in and grab it. It does have, maybe hard to tell, double pane windows. So it is very quiet on the interior once you get in. Kind of come in here and show you. Um, has lots of uh, pop-ups for options and stuff you can select. Um, Tesla's pretty known for having fun stuff like uh, car karaoke, arcades, and toy boxes. Um, go over here and like select energy and see like the consumption. Click on this and you can see all of the um, heating and cooling, the HVAC system here. You can see it has dog mode, camp mode, and uh, keep. You can turn on auto so it's auto climate completely. Front and rear. Whoop front and rear heating access for the seats from the front seat here. Turn on auto, it'll automatically kick over to adjust the temperature to what I need it to be. Car has a lot of really neat features. You can come into the main control panel here and check everything out. Um, go like charging, it kind of shows you the charge rate and how well that works. You can change what mode you're in. You can change how everything is displayed. So has dual charging ports here for phones. Pretty big storage bin down here. Cup holders. So here's your keys. I'm not going to take them out, but it uh, may be hard to see. But that little black thing is a basically just a card, like a gift card or a credit card, that you use to access the vehicle. And when you get in, you just stick it right in this little section right here, and that's what allows it to drive. So you use the uh, side stick here, the stock, to go do whatever gear you're looking for. So go down into drive, pops up and go into reverse, pops up side cameras, rear view mirrors, it's got an edgeless rear view mirror as well. It may be hard to tell but it has a giant sunroof up front and then the rear actually transitions all the way down into the rear glass so that's all one big panel and this is one big panel as well so it has two big panels as the sunroof obviously this is used to control your uh, windshield wipers it has two steering wheel controls that are used for quite a bit on the vehicle like you can turn the volume up and down so here's another neat little feature this is your door handle right here. It is just a press of a button and the door unlocks, and that is it. So I'll show you the frunk, which is your front trunk, and then the rear hatch. We'll check those out. So because this car does not have an actual combustion engine, it has space in the front for storage. It's not large by any means but it is helpful in a car this small so has a neat little design there just clicks into place no problem the rear hatch automatically fully opened by itself once again storage space is pretty adequate um not huge but it does have a secondary compartment down here for storage where when they come from the factory that's where they um, come with the 120 volt charger can just uh, hit, hit the button and it closes up. So, pretty neat little car. Um, figured while we have it on the lot here, give you guys a quick tour of it and put it on our channel so you guys can enjoy that. So, 
So it will be for sale soon. Um, if you're interested in it, you can call us at 417-720-4995 or check us out on our website, social medias or anything like that um, at Enterprise Motorsports, LLC.